Hello friends, today we are going to discuss in vivo methods for the screening of anti-catatonic drugs or the drugs which shows anti-catatonic activity. This model is the haloperidol indos catatonia in rats or it is also popularly known as haloperidol indos catalepsy. If you like this video, kindly subscribe this video to get more and more knowledge about preclinical pharmacology. Now, what is Parkinson? Parkinson disease is a chronic progressive disorder of the central nervous system, which is results of damage to cells located in the basal ganglia of the brain. The three cardinal manifestation of Parkinson disease are, first is a kinesia, it is also called as bradykinesia. This is a lack of difficulty in initiating voluntary muscle movement. And in advanced stages, is characterized by frozen muscle resulting in mask-like faces, impaired posture, reflux, and inability to care for oneself. Second is the rigidity. This is usually a plastic or cogwheel type that is, it gives way in series of jerk. And third is the tremor. Tremor is the repetitive muscle activity, usually worse when the patient is at rest. It's commonly manifested as a pill rolling motion of the hands and bobbing of the head. Now, what is catatonia? This catatonia is a group of symptoms that usually involves a lack of movement and communication and also can include agitation, confusion and restlessness. It is a immobility and rigidity in the animal, which is also known as the catalepsy. Most of the antipsychotic drug, when administered at high doses, produces catalepsy in experimental animals. This behavior has long been used as a model for extrapyramidal side effect associated with antipsychotic uses in human. Thus, catalepsy is condition of diminished responsiveness, which are usually characterized by the tremor and rigidity of the muscle. So the drugs which uh, reverse or reduces this catatonic activity are called as anti-catatonic drugs. So such drugs might increase dopamine transmission or reduces cholinergic transmission and inhibit uh, drug-induced catalepsy. Now, what are the requirements for this test? For this test, you can carry out this experiment in rats as well as in the mice. So for rats, you have two options. You can take the wooden box, wooden blocks, I, and three centimeter for mice, six and nine centimeter for rats. Likewise, you can use such a glass rod, which can be elevated at three centimeter for mice and six or nine centimeter for rats. You can use the haloperidol antipsychotic drug, which uh, at high doses, that is 1 mg per kg intraperitoneally in rat, produces the catalepsic behavior. And you can use the test substances like amantadine 70 mg per kg per orally or any test drug which you have, you can administer to the animal before administration, before administration of haloperidol. So the time interval after administration of your test drug is 30 to 1 hour, 30 minute to 1 hour duration. Now here, the process is simple. You can divide the animal into two groups. One is the control and the test. Control group received haloperidol, 1 milligram per kilogram IP, and the test group received the test substances at a decided dose. After 30 minutes, administered haloperidol to the same group. Then for both this group, the observation are uh, similar. So in observation, you have to score catatonia 
at different time interval like 15 30 45 60 90 and 120 minutes after administration of the haloperidol now how it is score catatonia score for control and test groups are carried out like this stage 1 if rat moves normally when placed on the table then score it as a 0 if rat moves only when touch or push when if you touch the animal or push the animal then only it will move then score it as 0.5 then in stage 3 if rats front paw place alternatively on 6 cm height block as shown in the figure then it is a score and if the rat fails to correct the posture in 10 seconds then score is 0.5 for right paw and 0.5 for left paw and total score is 1 then stage 4 rats front paw place alternatively on 9 centimeter height block if fails to correct the posture in 10 seconds then score 1 for right paw score 1 for left paw and total score is for 2 Similar scoring can be carried out for the elevated rod. You can place the rod and carry out the same scoring in the animal. Then after you can prepare this observation table like serial number. You have to take the animal weight in gram, then drug and dose you can write here. Then mean catatonic score after minute after of treatment. So this is 15 minute 30 45 60 90 whatever score you are getting you can put the score if you and then at the end you can make the mean similarly the same experiment is performed for test animal and then at the end compare the catatonic score of control that is haloperidol induced animal to that of the treatment group and from that you can you can come to know that the given drug having the anti-catatonic activity or not. So, uh, let's see how this experiment is performed uh, by using the rat and thanks for listening this uh, presentation. Actually, what mechanism is that? Tell me, what is it?